can never you can never do what we do and we can never do what you do yes i'm going to friends on your bitch ass until you show me that you're worth more than that yes i'm going to flake on your bitch ass until you show me you're but you're worth more than that so yes i'm going to keep on putting the tip in yes i'm going to keep on digging and stroking to you youtube what it do it's your boy steph man welcome back to another video topic we're gonna dive into a cold video but before we do make sure you guys follow me on instagram at steph is cold and make sure you guys also follow me on twitter at steph is cold today's video topic we're gonna watch a video of a woman explaining why um women are single so without further ado let's dive into the video topic we're about to play the video right now put it on the screen i got a couple comments i want to read in the video as well let's dig into it women are choosing to be single and dealing with less because y'all sat here and gave us so much on why we should be fucking doormats to y'all emotions on, Randy. opposed to taking accountability for the fact that you ain't healed yourself from the show I'm gonna do it to you. Come on, Randy. Come on, Randy. She said, she said, yeah. All right. Let's, let's look at some comments now, shall we? Let's look at some comments. Pull up this comment right here, right? I'm gonna pull up my boy. Uh, Kari Burko Shout out to Kari Burko So Kari Burko says this He says Women have no choice to be single Because they don't have They don't hold the keys to a relationship The men they want The men that they want aren't offering them relationships But the men they don't want are And that's when they choose to be single Right this other woman comment back so basically we should settle for who wants us even if we don't like them why can't we like who we like and choose not to be with the man that we don't like men don't settle they get what they want from women if she is just sex material then that's what he will use her for if she's wifey material sometimes he will marry her why do women have to just take whatever it is offered to her just because it's available y'all don't also, this has, this has nothing to do with money or looks. I've met some fine rich men who are toxic as hell, mean, rude, insensitive, insensitive, and selfish. They want me. I don't want them. So should I settle for him or vice versa? A man could not be on the same mental, emotional, financial, or spiritual playing field as me. But because he wants me, I should settle. Men don't settle. They get what they want 90% of the time. She, when, when, when they say men don't settle, they're talking about the elites. They're talking about the very few men. Let's continue on my boy, Kari Burke, who says, no, no women don't have to settle, but they do have to earn their spot in a man's life. As far as long-term relationship, men settle way more that you feel they do. Let me say that one more time. Men settle way more than you feel you do. There's a small percentage of men that can easily get what women want, what, what they want from women. Let me say that one more time. There's a small percentage of men that can easily get what they want from women. Majority of men have to put in more work to even get a woman's attention, let alone sex or a relationship. A man will for sure use a woman for sex until he until she shows that she's more than her coochie. Women don't have to take what's offered, but women aren't good at seeing what's in front of them as far as what they truly desire in a man. Ooh, we that's a good one. Women are trash at vetting men properly for relationships. Most times what's available is what they qualify for. Mm, relationship wise. Mm. Most times what's available is what they qualify for relationship wives. Women truly believe that they don't have to earn protection and provision from a man they desire. They feel that they all have to do is show up. Those toxic rich men are obviously men you should skip and go for men that makes enough money to provide a modest yet fulfilling lifestyle as well as to treat a woman properly. There's toxic character characters on all financial levels. The point is to vet those men properly for the character, not just their financial situation. Don't settle, but vet vigorously on the man's character, regardless of his financial level, to see if he's a man you respect, admire, and want to follow. You know, and 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 I want to say this, man. 
I want I want to say that the, the number one thing to a man's downfall is listening to the advice of what women give about relationships. That that is a downfall. That that is something that you never ever you never want to want to listen to what this woman is saying, right? Right? Here's the truth, bro. Here, here here's why women are upset. Right? Let me ask you this question. Who holds the keys to the relationship? Who holds keys to the relationship? Who are the gatekeepers to the relationship? Us. Us men. Right? So if we hold the keys to the relationship, why why do you feel as if you you don't have to qualify for my provision and my protection and my finances and my non-sexual attention and my resources just because you have a coochie think about that bro think about how that that is how entitled women are like they don't have to do anything but just feel like they can show up So the guys that's in your phone that your text that's texting you that's in the friend zone those are the guys that want to be in a relationship with you but you don't want to be in a relationship with those guys because for some reason they don't sexually turn you on for just some reason you don't want to be with them at all so you're not going to settle you're not going to settle at all but look at look at look at look at andrew wiggins that rumor, whether it's true or I hope it's not true, but that rumor that's going around with his girlfriend talking about the DNA test ain't real. That might not be his kids. Um, his best friend was sleeping with his girl. That's why he been missing like 15 games. He's settling. Do you know how many men settle and stay in relationships just simply because he he for the love of his woman or he just want to make it right with the kids? Women don't do that. It's not even in a woman's nature to do that. Women jump ship when when shit get run. That's you think men monkey branch, nigga? Women monkey branch, nigga. They jump ship. She's gonna jump ship when shit hits the shit. She up out of there. Men settle the most. Men are the ones that are in sexless or it's like sexless marriages and sexless relationships. Men are the ones that have to go in the bathroom and <laughs> beat they meat. Cause they women don't want to get him sex. The same woman that he's paying bills for, he's feeding, taking care of the children, the home, things that he's supposed to do. He gets nothing in return. Oh, you want we want to talk about settling as a woman. You have to prove that you are worth more than just your coochie. The same way I have to prove my value and my worth in this world, you have to prove your value and your worth to a man for a relationship. Because you prove your value and your worth to that, to that, to that, to that, uh, that coochie, them sweet watery guts. You proved, ah, I'm finna, she finna stuck me till I'm buck. Like, yeah, you proved your value in that area. But you know that as men, we are um, compartmentalizers. I think I said that word right. So, yes, I'm going to continue to use you for sex until you show me that you're worth more than that. It's the same way that, yes, I'm going to continue to use you for your non-sexual attention until you show me that you're more than that. Ain't that what y'all do to us? Yes, I'm going to friends on your bitch ass until you show me that you're more that you're worth more than that. <laughs> yes, I'm going to flake on your bitch ass until you show me you're you're worth more than that. Y'all do the same shit. So yes, I'm going to keep on putting the tip in. Yes, I'm going to keep on digging and stroking to you ah! until you prove and show to me why I should do more. But see the problem is bro you got you got super masculine women who who who, who want you know what i'm saying the, 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 the top the, the cream of the top 
and and they feel as if you know women who are you know successful and they got money they feel as if they deserve deserve the right man they feel like as if they 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 don't have to work for the top guy just because they pretty or just because they they have money in it maybe it just don't work like that i hate to say it but it it, it really don't work like that it's more it's, it's way more to it than that so as a as a man you know men men start away more than women you know what i'm saying you know unconditionally loving someone is settling because you know let's just be real man how many how many men we know that's in marriages that's in it for the kids bro miserable as hell miserable as hell you know why he's miserable because he's settling he's not happy he's settling he has happy days but he's not happy the long duration of the relationship he's not happy because he's settling russell wilson you settled for sierra look at look look at look at his face does he look happy no gotta ask yourself this this is this is why you have to strive to be the best man you can be because you have to ask yourself i have all these boxes checked why would i settle as a man see see you know why women always try to men do it too men do it y'all do it all the time so then it's like when they try to do what a man do the shit ain't working that's biology that's nature you can never you can never do what we do and we can never do what you do Ain't no way in hell I'm finna wait 60 days before I drop off some digging stick. Ain't no way in fuck I'm finna try to get some sort of emotional connection with a bitch before I drop off some digging stick. You got me fucked all the way up. Ain't no way in fuck I'ma give it. I gotta like a chick first before I give her a digging stick. Man, I'm finna fuck the shit out of her and bounce. Women are not wired like that. They can say it all they want. They can say, I, I, I can have sex with a guy and I'll think about it and I'll forget it. They can lie. See, that's it. See, women can lie all day, but nature never lies. Nature never, never lies. He he can have a he can have a girlfriend, but I ain't gonna get jealous. I could be the side bitch. But guess what? Nature always lies. I mean, nature never lies. She's always gonna get jealous. So never listen to what a woman say. Always listen to what a woman does and always listen to I mean always watch her, you know, her resume. Look at her resume, you know what I'm saying? The years of the bullshit that she been through. You know what I'm saying? Um that's the video for today, fellas. Don't forget to like this video, man. Comment, subscribe, holla back at your boy.